It's what goes into making an airplane environmentally progressive. A coat of non-chrome primer. It has fewer pollutants than standard primer, and it cuts down on the cost of handling and disposing of those materials. Time-lapse video shows the chrome-free coating process on this 777 for Air New Zealand. You have to be relentless about it. You know, no one's going to change the, the you know, the, the environment overnight, but you've got to look at everything and you've just got to keep it to become your way of life. It's the first airline to benefit from Boeing's plan, combining 10 environmentally conscious initiatives on a single plane. So working with Air New Zealand, they're very environmentally forward. They're very enthusiastic about working with us. One approach comes with a pull of this lever. During testing, crews have to frequently flush out the system and then replenish it with clean water. We used to dump every three days, so that's two water tanks of water for a 777 every three days. However, lab testing found they could safely extend that to seven days because bacteria levels were so low. That should save nearly 1,600 gallons of water for 777s built in the coming year. Everybody's walking the same line in terms of thinking grain and how everything we do daily affects our environment. Boeing is also cutting back on engine run tests. Since engine maker GE already performs them, Boeing found it could safely scale back and save 800 gallons of fuel per plane. Such a big team effort because it incorporates everyone from the beginning to the end and after. We look at all the little things we can do along the way and they'll add up and that's what I would encourage everyone at Boeing to keep doing as well. It's an effort that can save money, time, and have less of an impact on the environment, making an already efficient 777 even more so.